This time we go to foot to hand, okay? So let's get clear about the ending position. Someone, a flyer, standing on your hand, how is that gonna be possible to support that weight, okay? Um, the first thing to keep in mind is this puts a tremendous amount of weight into your um, arms there. So how do you balance that in a way that won't get you hurt? So worst falls first. Back, let's do thrown first, maybe. Actually, let's teach it from throne to foot to hand. That might be easier. Okay, worst falls. Here, I'm here. The flyer is so heavy, and they don't engage their thighs that my arms go straight out. And this hurts your arms bad, because if the weight goes out this way, it can twerk, uh, tweak your shoulder. So if you're here and then the weight goes like that really fast, it can really damage your shoulder. So let's keep in mind that as the uh, worst fall. And um, now let's break down what you can do as a flyer to really help your base with this. So we are in throne. I'm going to watch my hand placement here. <clears throat> Not so much towards the balls of the feet. For me personally, I really like grabbing right around the heels and then my hands are around her feet like that. For this one, you want to actually grab tight. You're low enough to where she's not going to get hurt by falling. This, this one, you worry less about the flyer safety and more about the base's safety because you can, again, tweak that shoulder. She's low enough to where it won't, won't be too bad. Um, I'm squatting my legs so I can meet her lower. I get my elbows down the ground. And that eye stack is important, right? To be able to find a common mistake is this. Find that nice stack where it's nice and 90 degree perpendicular to the ground, OK? From here, it's very important that the flyer helps. She can grab onto my feet. Look, watch my foot here. I'm gonna just slide off her butt. She said, grab my foot. Push down into it like that. Stay on, don't let go yet, Mary. Just click on her first. Put a little more weight into the hand. There you go. Do that first. She's putting about 50% of her weight into my feet. This is a much safer way to start. So she's here, I'm grabbing her feet this way. My arms are stacked. Play with that stack first. A common mistake for the flyer is that they'll bend at the waist. Will you demonstrate that, Magda? They'll do this. Push your hips forward, but put weight into the uh, feet there still. So you work on that. Another common mistake is flyers will look down because they're trying to spot the fall. you got to look forward. Yeah. When you look down, you're bringing weight too much into the base's hands. Also, you're bringing more of your torso down this way, which will create a more likely fall forward. She's looking forward. Her hips are forward. Her shoulders are back. Her chest is forward. She's putting putting a lot of weight into my feet there. She's leaning in back a little further, putting weight into my feet. There it is, Magda. For now, that's what we want. And then slowly you can play with that. Taking one hand away, putting more weight into this other foot. And then she can slowly let go of the other one. And I always keep my feet up here in case she falls back. What happens? Right there. Right there right there so she can build that trust with her flyer that she can push her hips forward because she'll feel like i'm falling back but the more you can build that trust my feet are back there to catch you she can trust it more and really push her hips forward okay. let's demonstrate one more time Magda, from the start there Put weight into the feet there, man. Good. Let's just do that. Let's do this for today. Hips forward, keep putting weight into the feet. There it is. That's what we want for today. And work towards uh, less and less weight on the foot slowly, okay? Coming down like that. Clarifications. Okay, let's team up again. Um, you two? Cool.